Hey, what's up, everyone? Upstart here with Rise Gaming, and welcome back to another episode of Subnautica. So, in our previous episode, uh, we activated that alien arch or portal gateway. I forget what they call it, phase gate or something like that. I forget what it's called. What they, what the uh, precursor, uh, what the architects call it. Um, anyways, um, I meant to do that at the end of the other episode, the one prior to the previous one. But I, it, I just completely forgot. I, I think, I think I had ended that one right before an hour was up, and I'm like, I probably could have done it in that time and check what it was about real quick, five ten minutes, and that was it. But anyways, I did it in the beginning of the previous one. Uh, from there, we, um, from there we started making our way over to like searching for the, um, the cave cavern system with the fossils blah blah basically the lost river area right uh, I'm trying to go into these things where are it? where is it alien data hmm where were the locations at I forget codes here oh, right there okay so and uh, um, basically the lost river area so where um, we can get to the disease research facility uh, we you know we did that I got lost, but before that, uh, at the uh, when we were before we even made it to the cavern area, like to the entrance areas, we um, got to like the sea trader like area where they're at. You know, I don't know, migrating or just cruising around, whatever. And well, it took me a while there, but because I need, I wanted to get, I wanted to get, and I felt like I, it's something I needed to have or to get um, to get the drill. The drill arm for the prawn suit and I'm just making sure I don't have any bugs on my ship which we'll get to in a moment so then we got down there it was a mess for me but we managed to get through it um, we scanned a few skeleton remains Leviathan skeleton remains we made it to the disease facility which um, it was kind of uh, how do how, would I, how should I explain this I got lost because I'm like it didn't occur to me to just well we, it's hard to even see so let me let me just go on a little rant here so if you're if you're navigating let's say you're going straight right um, so supposedly the entrance to the disease facility or to that little cavern area where the disease facility is or disease, disease research facility um, it was before we got to the tree but you had to actually like make a sharp right to be able to even see it there's no way we were we were going to be able to see it i'm like it was going to be like on the side and it's kind of like at a sharp turn sharp sharp angle hard to see yeah that pissed me off but anyways we got that we found that uh, and then um there was actually uh we were on, we entered from one side and there was actually another tunnel going or another entrance or exit or something on the far side of that uh, and it took us to like some thermal vent area there's a ghost leviathan there but it just took me out to an exit there was I, th I thought we were going somewhere like with like maybe not the lava zone but like some area with um, with thermal vent activity or thermal activity but it, it just kept getting, it taking me up, 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 and up until I got out of the place. And I'm like, uh, I think this is the wrong way. So in case you want to, there's another entrance there. I don't know where it comes out to. I don't really care <laughs> because I want to stick here. So here we are. Uh, I've moved out from the, the research uh, cavern. What in the world happened there? <laughs> did I just move my, <laughs> did I just move it <laughs> by falling onto that part? That's uh, That's kind of uh buggy glitchy whatever uh don't do that again creep me out i mean trip me out anyways uh so i left that area and i made my way back so now now we had to go straight through the tree area where that giant cove tree whatever it's called straight through it and then on the other side there's another tunnel or like another cavern area and then there's more like trees or roots or whatnot or those um those blue finger root thingies and then at, at the edge of that, there's a dead end, but there's like a cliff type of thing, and you have to go down. You basically got to dive down further, and that's where we come out here, more or less. Anyways, that's about it there. 
So let's go out just real quick, just because I want to take a quick look at what I have going on down here. So I have me, I have built me a little something right there. It's just the moon pool with the vehicle upgrade thing, and I have that right there. No hatch uh, with a bioreactor in there for, for energy. That's basically what I got going on there. Because since... No bugs? Okay, no bugs. Since we have nickel now, we were able to make the prawn suit jump upgrade, and we could make the prawn suit depth module mark one, which we also need because we're we're below 900 uh, 900 meters, and that's like the maximum for the prawn suit. So you know, got that one. We just need kyanite to be able to upgrade it. We go into here. Uh, also for this one, we know we need kyanite to upgrade that one. We already have that one. We need to get that one. Same here. We need kyanite. Uh, and I think that's basically it right there. I'm holding on to both of those modules right there. Uh, I was planning on doing it on my own, but I'm like, you know what? I think it's. I've been told uh, that I'm like, if it's a gameplay thing, shouldn't you like to show everything or just like try to show most of the progress? And I'm like, um, yes and no at the same time because yes, you, you sh it's if it's a gameplay playthrough series type of thing. Well, then you should be kind of showing everything. But then again, there's a lot of time wasted in between. So it's not, uh, it probably shouldn't be like there should be parts where it's cut off. Like make a cut here. Okay, moving from point A to point B. We've already done it. So there's no point in, in showing that, right? Um, so, but I'm like, I probably should do this part at the very least. Okay, showing that I'm do getting this. I, I didn't even show where I, when I built the the facility right there the little habitat with the mod uh, moon point whatever um, but at least I kept it there at the very least anyway that's enough of that so let us equip this that one 1300 meters good we're gonna stick with this I don't feel like I need the other one the the just the grab arm so we're gonna keep that also I've got I've been cruising around a little bit outside to see what there was Be obviously I had to do that to build the um, the little my little base that's right there uh, so I there's magma magma rings here and there's red eyes or red eye eyes there's also some bugs now let's get to the bugs that leech that latch onto this and I don't know what they do exactly I haven't left them long enough to figure it out I might be able to figure it out if I read the data we have on them after scanning them because I did scan them already all I know is I have to come out here and then slash at them, kill them. So that's one. There's supposed to be three. And I don't think, and I believe one hit does not kill them. And I don't, you need like three. Okay, good. It's dead. Uh, okay. There was a third one. There it is right there. Sometimes the hitbox is kind of off. So yeah, make sure I kill that thing. If you leave them alone, they come back. So there's warpers around here. Anyways. I just came to check if there's anything on here. I don't know what they do. Like I said, if we check in here, we might be able to figure it out. Databank, it should be in uh, indigenous life forms, fauna, maybe small. They're not herbivores, that's for sure. They're parasites, yeah, that's what they are. Larva right here. We'll look at this, let's see what it says. Does it tell us anything? A grub-like species with, which appears to lack sight and smell, but is able to sense and drain thermal and electro energy in its immediate environment. So it drains energy, okay, so that's what it does. So we had like 70%, okay, so it did drain us. We did drain a little bit, un unless it was us that used that energy up. Anyways, I think we should get moving. Oh, I was, but now that thing's on my... Right there. Eh. I think there was one that I didn't kill, I believe. So I think that's the one. I don't remember. Can you die? Die, 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 die. Overkill. Double tap. Either that or, or you know, or, or die. <laughs> yeah, kind of aggressive, don't you think? Well, yeah... But if you don't double tap something, make sure it's dead. Well, it might come back to bite you in the ass. Anyways, 
So looking out here, there's that way over there. There's also a path down in that direction. But the last time I was here, I think I went to the right. I think I went in this direction. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? That way. It kind of got pushed ahead, so I was further back. I'm just going to leave. Well, actually, no. Hold up. Hold up. Real quick. I'll be right back. Anyways, I'm just going to come back real quick because uh, I'm just going to say mention about that since I have a better view. So I put a beacon there. I'm like, you know what? Let me just drop the beacon there, and then I had to come back out because there's these bosses right here draining me of energy. Damn, hitbox, terrible. Or is it just me that I'm, that's terrible? So yeah, that's that's the way we're going to go in. Right there, I believe. We came from that direction, obviously, so we're going to go that way. There is a little something something over there. I can't really tell. There's a little something over there, and then I don't think there's anything else in that direction. I think that's a dead end right there. Anyways. Carrying on. Okay, let's go. Yeah, that doesn't seem like it's very, very useful. That's an infected bug, or parasite, lava, whatever. Do I have to keep going down? Do I have to keep going down? I don't recall which side I actually went. I can't, I can't look that far to the left to see if I am... If I've actually done something, like uh, if anything has latched on. So, real quick, we'll stop here. Because we can't see below us. Oh, wait, 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 hold up, hold up. There's some, We should probably use this feature. No bugs? Okay. Because I never use them. No, no sounding, no horn. Cameras. So, this is our keel, which is obviously the bottom. Oh, oh, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, camera light. So there's light right there. Mm, nothing there. And if I mouse wheel, this is the screw, whatever that is. Oh, at the back, basically. Basically at the rear. At the butt. That thing's coming to, oh, the other way. And this from the top. Oh look, we got a we got a bastard right there. Okay. All right. BRB. All right, let's move it because there were like six on that thing, and then as soon as I was getting done with one or when it, with with like a few of them, more came on me. Came on board, and they're trying to hitch a ride. I'm like, nah, 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 ain't about that. There's a one man ship, one man crew. Anyways, uh, something latch on it did is right there. Never mind, it it didn't manage to latch on apparently. I say apparently because I checked the the little monitor thing and it didn't show anything so I don't know if I'm going the right way maybe I had gone the other way because I'm not seeing any kyanite at all well there's one right there there's another one probably over there okay so what we're gonna do is we're gonna like ram that oh, so there's the regular rays so let me try to calculate where the prawn suit is. Oh, there's some more right there. I'm gonna stop it around here. Let's see if we got the right spot. Probably not. But we're not gonna open drop just yet. Oh, we're way too high. Okay, so that's right there. We're nearly where we want to be. But we should drop down. Nice. Now we got some more light out here. You no 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 no. Hey 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 hey. What you doing? What you doing? What you think you doing, boy? We got another one on the face right there. There's one over there coming over here. It definitely wants to latch on. I bet you. I ain't gonna. I ain't gonna give it that chance. Preemptive attack here. Die. All right, there's the, that ray. So let's go. Scan the regular ray. Crimson ray. Oh, is this the regular one? 
Hmm. Is that something latched on? Oh no, it's dead. Okay. Double tap, double tap, just in case. I wasn't sure. We got one right here. Okay, so like I said, I'm just gonna get a little bit. Uh, I'm just gonna dive a little bit more. Oh, on the face, it's right there. I'll leave it for now. Where am I, when, when am I gonna stop? As soon as this thing tells me. Yeah, that we <laughs> perimeter, <laughs> perimeter. Okay, so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna turn this off. I think I'm gonna try. I'm gonna. I have a. I have an idea of what I can do right now. It's probably not a good one though. Is that latched on or is it? <laughs> it's holy damn. Nope. 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 I don't give it. I don't give a damn. Use two. I got way so many of. Them. I got way too many of those. I got so many of those. Ah. <laughs> that. That I could care less if I use two or three. Anyways, so we are gonna drop like around there. We technically do have Are we able to reach this? That's that's the question. That's the real question. Or I can just drop down here. Yeah, because that's kinda high. We can probably reach it, but it's gonna be a bit maneuver it's gonna require some maneuverability. Whatever, let's just drop, let's go. Oh yeah, my my idea, my plan is uh remove all my <laughs> All my batteries just leave like one or two or so or just remove all the power cells so they won't get drained while I'm not here definitely remove that one I'll leave like like that one just for basic uh, like for the basic power stuff but we'll take the 100 ones out you will take that one out as well we'll leave the 36 only for now I don't think we're in that big of a, uh, of a you know predicament or we'll get into one right here nothing seems to be aggressive and there's no the Leviathan nearby that we can see yeah so you've probably already noticed that I like to uh, that's this is why I like this tree why I love it so much um, it's not something that um, you know you can carry around with you because it, it does perish real real quickly but you know, just grab a ton of them, because as you can see, this thing like just spawns up shit ton of them. Anyways, and you just spam it, and that's it. Fill up. Haven't been using any water at all. Yeah, those are there. They're definitely gonna drain that battery. And since they are, I think I might as well just remove it. <laughs> I wonder. I might as well remove that one too. No, no, no. What you doing? What you doing? Are we offline? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Do they leave? What? Minus 2,147. Will it be detrimental to us? As long as it doesn't destroy our ship, I could care less. Let's say... Will I, be, will I even be able to release? I need to repair that. If I can release, then that's fine. Uh, maybe. Sh yeah, it's either on top of it or nowhere else. Ah! Did it get me out of the prawn? Little shit. Can I kill it with this? I don't think I can. I ah! Whatever, just keep it there. Ah, get out of my way. Ah! There's so many things on this. You know what? Can I? Yeah, you better. You better teleport away. Oh, shit, man. Whew. Okay. Thank you. 
Oh, again? You gotta be kidding me. Ah! Motherfucker. Pissing me off here. Pissing me off. I, I know it doesn't care. I know it doesn't care. Can you take damage? I hope you did. Oh, but that's not it. <laughs> that's not what took damage. We took damage. Hold up, hold up, hold up. I don't want this destroyed. Hell no. Prepare this. How much battery we got? We still got 50%, more or less. Uh... Damn thing takes a while to repair. Okay, so I don't really care about anything except for, obviously, the Kainite. Kainite is the only thing that's important to me here. Let's go for it. We're barely at, well, we're just kind of barely at the limit here. I, I want to get the, the charger for this because then I could be switching out the batteries and I could, then I, now I have a way to, and then I would have a, a way to charge my power cells. By just keeping this... <laughs> Like, let me, like, oh, you know what? I need to charge my batteries. Let me leave my, my prawn suit near, a, near the, like, in the lava or something and let it charge. I'll bring it back with you all. <laughs> you know what's funny? It's, see, that's not funny. It's, it's not a joke. It's funny because it's not a joke. Because I think that's a good idea. Can we actually break that? No, it's just aesthetics. Okay. What's this right here? It looks like nickel. Oh, silver. Never mind, not nickel. But kyanite is more important. Doesn't matter. Uh, move it, move it, move it. That might be nickel or gold. I can't really tell. The color's kind of off. Ah, not again. Can we actually damage it? I don't think so, right? It doesn't look like we can actually damage that. I think we'll, with what we've got, I think we have enough to get the upgrades that we want. Um, so I think I'm going to grab them now. Um, I don't remember if one of the things I wanted to get was uh, was still back at the... I, I still needed to get the Lava Lizard. I know these are... I think these are aggressive. I'm pretty positive they are, so yeah, let me grab that while I'm below it. Let's get out of here. Um... We got attacked, okay. Okay, it doesn't open automatically. I, I kind of expected that because it's, there's no power in it. But it was able to like let us out, so that's why I was kind of not sure. Anyway, as long as I can go in through here, I could care less. I didn't get the Kainite. I know it's still in the storage. I'm just here to add some... To add some power real quick. Just add the cheapest one. That one. The cheapest one. I mean, I meant the one with the least amount of power. Y'all know what I mean, right? That's how I spoke it, you know? That's how I spoke it. Alright, alright. So, if I'm not mistaken, I should be able to get in there from, like, right here. And even though I'm in reverse position, oh no 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 no! This way, this way, this way. Yeah, there we go. Got he. Right. So mod station. I'm just gonna grab those because I can, because I should. Okay. So, oh, obviously we can't do anything because the modules are in here. And I think we should be fine. I don't. I think that is that one doesn't upgrade. So we're just gonna grab this one. With that, it's since uh, because of the easy craft, I believe it also grabs it from other inventory, so I don't necessarily need to grab it. Okay, so that was the main thing right now. Where is it? Drop that in there. I also want to do the one for this uh, for the uh, where is it? Right there. I gotta do it real quick because then we're gonna start uh, getting hull damage, and that's definitely not good. Come on, come on, come on, come on. 
Luckily we're full. I don't know how much damage, how how fast our thing will go, and that's not good. Come on, go 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 go. Get it back in there. Get it back in there. <laughs> Wherever it goes, I don't care. <laughs> Just put it in there. Just put it in. <laughs> I'll leave the rest of the joke to you all. Okay, so we took a little bit of damage. Not bad. It'll it'll regen over time. As long as it's not like there's like there's no like hole breaches or whatnot, it'll regen over time. As you can see, it's slowly or crawling. It's slowly crawling to you know towards the, the edge of that. Uh, what else am I missing? Oh yeah, am I? Oh look at this. Look at this, my friend. What you doing here, my friend? You did not receive an invitation. It's a one-man crew. What you doing here? Oh, look. <laughs> it's been drained. Real quick. Real, real quick. It's fine. It's not a big deal. Uh, thermal, thermal, thermal. Generator, regenerator. Uh, I think I do have to go back, right, to the... Will I make it? Will I make it on my own? I'm going to head back on my own. I'm going to leave the the... the, the I I just hope what I'm saying is very is is coherent, man. I, I don't know if I'm if I'm if my brain is right right now. I'm gonna I'm saying that I'm gonna leave the Cyclops here and I'm gonna make my way back to that beacon over there. I don't know if I'll even make it that far. I, I'm gonna tr I'll go with the Pronsu. I think that would be a good idea. Anyways, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna just uh, to make the. Um, to fabricate that one thing. I don't think I can fabricate it from here. It's unpowered anyways. <laughs> yeah. The the recharging thermal thingy. Blah, blah, blah. I'm, my brain isn't right right now. Well, just a little quick update here. I did make it. <laughs> there was a lot of jumping and jetting and maneuvering on like ledges and little little like little yeah, well, little ledges and all that because there was a lot of high areas, like high ground. That's how I was kind of like I was like, I don't know if it's coherent what I'm saying, but I'm going to do it. And I did. Uh, I also remembered before I came to get my materials because we are, because we're not going to be able to have them here on hand. So I did bring what I would need for it. Supposedly did. Uh, where is it? So let's see how stupid I look. Because I did bring everything. And I have the kyanite right there. So what am I missing? Did I miss something? Please don't tell me that. I thought I brought everything. I thought I was, I was foolproof. Yeah, foolproof that. I made all the parts beforehand. Well, I just needed to make the polyalanine or whatever it's called. I needed to make that. I think that's all I need. I, I, don't, I think I don't even need to have this place here anymore. But I'm just going to leave it there because there's no point in removing it. I probably could have done something else. Like, I think I could have done this, right? <laughs> And then just gotten up here. Anyways. So now that we have that upgrade, where is it? Now we have to remove one. <sighs> choose one, choose one. Uh, well, we need that and that. Uh, this one, preemptively hardest chases before collision and limit damage under normal conditions. Um, I don't know how this one helps out in reality. I don't know if it helps out like from if you're f having like... To avoid fall damage or like it just gives you more defense I don't know so I'm gonna go with this one because um, this one recharges and we are we are in a hot area so might as well take that one uh, we're fully charged so let's get out of here and let's make our way back I think what I should do I have some energy there I probably should switch out the batteries <laughs> Anyways, I'll see you back at the Cyclops, which is over there, nearly a kilometer away. Alright, so we are nearly there. Like 150, 100 meters left. Okay, there we go. Copper, I don't care about that. So, note to self, I would not recommend going into the lava <laughs> itself. I'm like, it charges on thermal energy, but I think 50 degrees Celsius is good enough. Uh, anything over that starts doing damage to the sh to the, the prawn suit. Just a little note right there, because I did try it. I actually like had it go down to like 69%, and then I charged it, and then I accidentally stepped on another spot, and then I went down to like what was it, 97%? Anyways, we got that. 
Um, I can just build more power cells. I'm like, I have a ton of batteries, right? That's what a lot of people will say. I'm like, well, where's the fun in that? <laughs> Is what I'm going to say. I'm just going to charge probably one or two or a few or whatever. Um, I don't think... Well, I, I don't think. I just hope it's not, it won't happen. I'm like, I would think maybe I could just leave the prawn suit somewhere chilling while I explore with, with that. But I'm like, maybe I should not do that. Anyways... I'm probably just going to wait out for this one to charge. Because I only put one power cell for one power cell to charge. Because it really isn't... Oh my goodness. Really? You get... I'm going to leave it there. Let it chill. Hopefully it doesn't get destroyed. I'm going to watch it from, from a distance. From a safe distance. Can I see it from here? I can. Barely. Can I get further into the glass? Oh, okay, right there. So I'm going to stay here a little bit and let's see how long it takes for it to charge. And then we'll be back and we'll continue exploring this area. Anyways. Alright, so I've charged just a, like a few batteries only. Uh, and this mofo just came over here tried to drain that one. Okay. So it takes like, what can I say? Like somewhere from a few to several minutes to charge just two power cells on that. It isn't very efficient, that's that's for sure, but it's definitely free. The problem are these bastards here that they keep draining our energy because they also do attach to the um, to the to the prawn suit. So at this point in time, uh, I think I've gotten like enough kind I'm gonna say enough because um, I haven't gotten a lot like just what I needed for with the for the upgrades and for the modules that's what I'm saying that's why I, I enough like I got enough of them so it's funny how I never got around to use the alien containment I don't even know if I'm if I'm gonna get to that point if I will be using it who knows maybe maybe not I don't know um, 83% how many are do we have on us we got three if it was one or two I guess whatever but three that's too much right <laughs> no 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 slash it make sure it dies it's dead okay where's the other ones I don't see the third one but I see this one right here Where'd it go? Where'd it go? I, didn't, I don't see. I don't see where it went. Okay, so let's go on this side. Sometimes they go on the tail. Oh, also on that part apparently. Get out of here. No hitchhikers. Oh, what the? Gotta be kidding me! I just took off three, and now three are already on there. Hold up. Be right back. All right, we've cleaned off our ship. Took me a little bit because I had to kill. I had to chase him and kill him. But anyways, seventeen hundred is our limit. As we go along, I, I bet you they're gonna. I bet you anything that they're, they're gonna continue to latch on, even if I'm in movement. So there's not much I can really do there. These lights suck down here. I hit something. It's probably not me hitting something. It's probably something latching on. So the reason why I only put one power cell in there is because oh that's I think I'm turning back around so don't go that way at least we can that can tell us that so we were supposed to go down to what 1.4 me I don't know if it's here or if it's in the in another area this is the only area that I, like it's red, it was like readily available or more like um better said it was like literally right in front of us um this volcanic lava area so I, I can only guess and to assume that maybe it's here but like I said it's 1.4 um, kilometers down so we're not there yet I'm gonna continue exploring because it seems like there's just a bunch of nothing here and I gotta find another like an area where I can continue going down or something anyways whoa 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 just like less than five seconds since I 
since I made that cut less than five seconds and that came out I'm like okay I think we found it I don't know it's weird did we find it I'm gonna leave my ship further away from that I've been hearing it this entire time but I, I didn't see anything like I've been hearing that moaning or that, that whatever you want to call it sound so I'm gonna put it like around here I want to I don't want to go too far because I'm gonna drop the uh, as I explore or well, as we explore well you know what no uh, it's gonna be on but it's gonna tr get turned off anyway so I don't want anything latching on so power should go out the lights should go out as well. well it's probably just ambient light what's this up there center of this what of this chamber to alien alien materials massive energy signature is it a bad idea to go alone like yeah it's kind of it kind of sort of is a bad idea I do want to drop oh look I hope it, I don't get attacked that's for sure um, Reaper bones oh we can scan them I didn't expect that Leviathan skeletal remains ah Warper get away from me Can we withstand this? What's that? Silver ore? So... I don't know if this thing... This I believe this is an emperor, right? Or is it the sea dragon or whatever? Will it attack us? Well, it doesn't look friendly. Oh, it's breathing fire. Breathing fire. Please don't breathe fire at my ship down there. Oh, it's going straight for it. Oh my goodness. Can I scan it? Can I scan it? I can't scan it. Do I have to get closer, like to the face? I do have to get closer, like to the face. Sea Dragon Leviathan. It's not an Emperor, then. I have to get real close up. Oh, please don't go for the ship. No, 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 no. Follow me. Can you see there's a little bug over here? Bugging you, like literally? Ah. At least it doesn't. Oh look, there's a chamber right there. So, what? <laughs> okay, so the disease facility and the other facility seem to be like in the same area, apparently. The generator, there we go. Please don't attack my ship. It is very close to my ship and I really don't want it near here. What the? Where'd it go? Wherever it went, as long as it's away from my ship, I could care less. So here's the entrance apparently, so yeah. We are 1200 meters. The volcanic rock which has formed in this area can be carbon dated to between whoa, 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 whoa. and 3000 earth years ago. I'll deal with that in a moment. I need oxygen. <laughs> I don't think the cyclops will fit in there, will it? Where is it? Where is it? Not here. That's all I know, not here. Yeah, I know, oxygen on offline, blah, blah, blah. Run, run, run. Put it in. Wait for the oxygen to regen. And then take it back. <laughs> and then take it back, just like that. No damage? Good. That's all I care for. I hear something out there and I don't think... And I don't like it. It sounds too close. Where is it? Where is it? Okay. We look like we're okay. I don't know. I can't help myself but like continue looking back over my shoulder. Whew. Okay. Inside here. 
Do I know which way I have to go? I have no clue. I'm just gonna swim around. Oh look, free kinet. Oh, I can. I should have scanned it. Should have scanned it. I just see something free, and I just want to grab it. Come on, quickly! I don't have all day. Okay. Some more eggs. Some more kyanite. I'm not really in in the market for the kyanite right now. I'm just trying to go around looking for. There it is, right there. I'm looking for tunnels. Is what I was saying. Or gonna say that? I didn't complete that. So there's a bunch of like individual kyanite. We got a an achievement called thermal activity. We're in. So as I was saying earlier, now that we've gotten you know a little break here, I just hope my ship is fine outside there. Uh, no, 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 not there. Locations? Where are they? Here. So apparently, inside an extensive natural rock formation. So the location for this, it's kind of weird because it said it differently in a way that we don't exactly assume. Like, obviously, this is a, you know, yours already. Game's already been out for a long time. Blah, blah, blah. Everyone already knows everything about the, this game. Anything. Anyways, we're in my playthrough. That's something else. And I'm kind of, it's kind of like new to me again because it's been a while since I've played. I still I remember some stuff, bits and pieces, and things come back every time I see stuff. I'm like, oh, I remember that and this and that. But anyways, as I was saying, so 1,200 meters. So the thermal power facility was here apparently. And this other thing, where is it? Ooh, do I remember? Do I remember? I don't remember. Ah! We were reading them earlier. Something about 1.4 kilometers into like down. That's probably for the facility where the the emperor is being held. Maybe I don't know. So we need to do that, but we'll get to that in a moment. What? Oh, I need to bring it here. Ah, okay, I'll be right back. I'm gonna bring my prawn suit. I definitely gotta get that. I can't leave that there. Be right back. There we go. Nice landing. Though, I think my battery is gonna get drained <laughs> due to the fact that I actually switched out two power cells to 100 to fully charged ones for um, for just two dead ones. And we got 10% by uh, just the little the little um, the little trek we we uh, we did right there to get here. Five ion cubes, six right there. I think that's it. You got seven. All right. So what I'm gonna do is I don't know if we need it right now or later on. We'll, we'll explore this solo. I'm gonna go outside. I'm gonna drop it like right here or something. And let's see. Yeah, so it's charging. Leave it there. I'll grab the loot. Take it all. We'll repair that 5% that was right there. And there we go. There we gotta go in there. Should be fine, right? <laughs> There's no ledge to leave it on, so I had to go. I had to compromise with something on something right there. So we'll get to that in a moment. We got that. It'll be funny if I find another. Well, I guess I shouldn't. Um, just I shouldn't just go like. Oh, I see another like uh, ion cube resource node. I shouldn't just go for it. I'm like, you know what? Just leave it there. I'll come back later. There's one here. No. I need to put a tablet there. Grab the data. We'll be back. Oh, what's in there? Oh, a lot of lightning. I mean, thunder. Green lightning. Green thunder. Oh no, thunder is the noise. Lightning is the the light, the energy, whatever. Ah. <laughs> okay, so we came from this side. Mm, I think that's the exit, so let's go. We already went that way to the right, so now let's go. Okay, we went that way. What about to the center? 
Oh, scan. Something scan. Oh, robots. Little bots. Little bots. Oh, no, no. That's not the five. Alien robot. I, do you attack me? I don't remember. So I'm just going to scan it and just leave it be. Okay, so it's another exit. Okay. All right. Or another entrance, whichever you prefer. Already went that way. This way now. Oh, look. Another arch. I guess we should activate it. Yeah, we should. Why not? It's active. <sighs> we should go inside. <laughs> let's go and let's see where this takes us. What well, took us as we, to what we can see up top, 91 meters uh, below sea level only when we were like, well, kilometer and a quarter down. All right, so we got dropped off somewhere. I have no clue where this is. Uh, it doesn't ring a bell where it is. It could be... Which one? No? Wait. Oh, it's the... It's the main... Um, it's, it's inside the, the reinforcement... Uh, the enforcement platform thingy, my bob. So, it's, so there was. I don't remember seeing this arch. I may have seen it, but I don't recall right now. So this one takes us all the way down to the thermal generator, so to speak, and inside the and it's inside the the enforcement facility. The other one's outside the enforcement facility, and it takes us to the floating island. Okay, I just wanted to keep make that clear. Okay, so how can that be useful? How is that useful? I don't know how that's useful. I really don't. Then again, thinking about it, I'm like, I could just leave this Cyclops there instead of having to make my way out <laughs> and make another one. Obviously, I have to get materials and this and that, ferry all the things. Anyways. So first, let's go to this one here now. We need two tablets. How many do we have? We have I think we have precisely just two. And now we have a different type of tablet, the blue one. I should scan it first, right? I haven't seen any other magnetite like well either or like uh, I haven't seen a small like the small single piece ones where you can just grab it and I haven't seen a, uh, any of the I think it was this side any of oh there we go come here to me what was I saying one of the bigger resource chunks or nodes yeah, I haven't seen either or. So I can't scan that. Scan the alien thermal plant. Can we get the other batteries now? I want the better batteries. Okay, I'll go there in a moment. I always have to do this. Because it's what I do. So I can go there. But then there's also the one at the bottom. We'll go to the one at the bottom first then. Because the other one seems like more important than this one. Data download. Integrating new PDA data. Let's open it before we lose it. Primary something, containment something. Volcanic area connected to this cave system at depth 1.4 kilometers. Primary containment facility. A power router router in the thermal plant is distributing energy collected out on site to other facilities on the planet. Primary containment facility location updated. Con constructed with a natural chasm. Within a natural chasm. Connected to this cave network. Seek fluid into 
south southeast area of volcanic activity depth 1.4 kilometers so that's probably the other one that we're talking about right um then there's power distribution self-warping quarantine enforcement units five percent arc network ten percent sanctuaries alpha beta kappa ten percent quarantine enforcement platform 35 percent disease research facility offline prim primary containment facility 20 percent reserve 20 percent there's no clear way to interrupt the power flow so this is probably our next destination which I'll say now it's going to be in the next episode. I'm going to cut this one as short as possible due to the fact that the previous one was nearly two hours. Ion power data. Very nice. I don't care about the batteries. <laughs> power cells. Power cells. Oh, but they need to. I need two batteries, so I have to care. <laughs> funny, 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 funny. I need water. I know. I'll be fine. So we got everything from here, I believe. We should be done. Let us head back to the prawn suit and head out of here. It says connected to this place, so I'm gonna do another test run with another like a backup save, so I can look for it, like look for the path, and we'll get to that in the next episode. But first, let's just make a power cell. Any damage? No, sixty-five percent. We're good. Uh, so which way was it? It was not in this uh, on this side. It was on the other side. Actually, where is... Where are we? No, 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 no. Oh, wait. Is it in that direction? Hmm. I can't see a thing. Wait. No, 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 no. Wait. wait, wait, wait. Oh, Warburg. No, Warburg. What are you doing? Alright, I'll see y'all outside. <laughs> I, don't, I don't even know which way to go. Oh, there's... there's all right, back inside our ship. Let's throw on that one. We need some oxygen back in here, but that's not the main thing I need. The main thing I need is to get power online. Actually, no, 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 no. Before I do that, let's make, let's fabricate. What's in here? New, oh, we can make the blue one now. Purple is ion cube two diamonds. Blue one is ion cube kyanite. Ooh, I'm gonna have to probably get some kyanite. Uh, just to be able to keep tablets on hand for when I need them. Okay, I can do that on my own. No big deal. Alright, so we need some of that. I'm just going to make two, maybe? Maybe three? I don't want to use up a lot of too much of the ion cubes because those are not... Uh, you know what? I'm going to stick with the one for now. Just with the one. The funny part is that it fully ch it kind of drains the battery <laughs> from uh from the the engine of the Cyclops to restore that one. Okay. So how much kyanite do I have? Do I have any? I forget. I have to hit the tab. So we've got some eggs right there just chilling. I have three kyanite there. I don't know how much more I have. So I think that's going to be it for this episode I, I think that's it so we've got those blueprints I don't think we have anything else particularly new besides you know like those things the blue tablet which I forgot what it requires I know it was kyanite but what was the other again oh no it was here in tools no 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 here Equipment. Ion cube, ion cube, K 
kyanite. All right, so what I'm going to do next, and this is going to be on my own, I'm going to probably go back inside, or, well, there's some over there. I'm going to look around for kyanite. I'm going to try to stockpile, like, I don't know, 20, maybe 50 at max, um, just to have some kyanite on me, because I don't have to be, uh, I prefer not to have, uh, to come back, like, back, uh, go back and forth from different places just to get resources I'm like I like to get a big old stack keep that and hopefully that lasts me the entire gameplay <laughs> anyways we have the diamond we just need the ion cubes which are kind of scarce so that's why it's better I just did one. Oh, it's out it's out now oh that's what was should be shown right here anyways my engine is off so it's all good like I said next is data bank data bank and was it again? Notes, codes, and thingies. Primary containment. This is where we're going to go next, I believe. It says, constructed with, within a natural chasm, connected to this cave network. It says this cave network, so I'm guessing where we got the data from inside the thermal plant. So this cave network is connected here somewhere, and we have to. it's an area of volcanic activity, depth 1.4 kilometers. So we've got to find that, and that's going to happen in the next episode for that. Anyways, it's, well, it's going to happen off camera, and then we're going to come back, and then we're going to do it, and we're going to get it on camera. Anyways. That's all for now. Thank you all for watching. Please subscribe if you want to see more. Hit that like button if you liked the episode. And I hope I didn't miss anything. See you next time. Bye-bye.